Hello and welcome to this video presentation from the One Stop Sat Shop and buymystuff.co.uk Today we're going to be looking at this uh, tool here you, know, you may say to yourself, what on earth is this? It just looks like a piece of metal Well, it is just a piece of metal but it is a very useful tool It's called an F-connector fitting tool This tool allows you to secure F-connectors to satellite receivers, cable boxes LMBs, distribution units, and really anything that has uh, F connector terminations on it for its tuner input. The tool is quite simple in operation. It has this uh, hexagonal sort of half section. Um, if you take a standard F connector, it fits just snugly in there. So it allows you to twist the F connector round, uh, only turning the nut, which is the important thing, and not twisting the cable as you put the uh, connector on. So I'm going to show you an example um, of how we can use this with a Sky satellite receiver. This is a Sky HD box. As you can see, it has two inputs. Now, in this case, these inputs are not that close together, so it's relatively easy to fit the F connectors. But in the next example, you'll see a case where the connectors are, in fact, much closer together. So to get this fitted, you just take the F connector, you can apply it onto the tuner input. You can give it, a say, a half turn just to get started. You take the tool, slide it over the connector, and just start turning around. And you can see that it's just the nut that's turning. The connector's not twisting, and we're not twisting the cable either. So it's not putting any strain on anything. We can turn this round a few turns, and now it's becoming very tight. So we've now got an extremely solid fixing uh, for that F connector. This is a much better approach to fitting an F connector than using a pair of pliers. Using pliers puts compression on the connector, which can squeeze the connector as you're turning it around. This can in turn strip the thread on either the F connector or the tuner input, which can then cause problems and that you may not be able to get the F connector off and refit it again. In order to take the F connector off, you just simply slide on the tool again and just start turning. You can get a fair amount of purchase on it, especially if you use both your hands. And there we go, there's the F, F connector come off. I think this show you uh, in operation here. We're turning it round and it's only the nut that's turning. We're not twisting the cable in any way. So there's no chance of your cable coming out or being damaged while you're doing this. So that's an example of us using the tool for a satellite receiver. This up, another example would be this quad LMB, which you may have seen before. It's a standard Sky quad LMB. Uh, it has four ports, and as you can see, these ports are much, much closer together. So it can be very difficult to get your fingers in there to uh, turn these F connector nuts round. So to fit the connector onto an LMB, again, it's quite straightforward. We can take the connector to the port again maybe giving it a little turn just to get it started, get the thread going, take the tool, put it on and then start turning around. And again, we're only turning the nut, not the cable. This can be very useful if you're outside and perhaps your fingers are cold, you know, and you can't get in to turn these connectors round. You can turn it around with an extremely tight fit. It's very important to get a nice tight fitting F connector uh, on an external connection because with the thread fully tightened like that, it, it reduces the, the risk of any water penetration. Water ingress can occur when the thread is fully tightened. If it's slightly loose, there is a possibility you know, of some water getting in there. So that's that nice and tight. Because the next problem you have, if you don't have a tool like this, is then coming to put cables on the next uh, ports. You can see the gap between the ports reduces every time you put another cable on. So here's a, a bare F connector. Just to show you putting the second port on, you can imagine there would be a cable connected to this. Just give it a little start. Uh, with your fingers. There we go. And then you can take the tool, slide it over, and start turning round. And again, it's just the nut that's being turned round. The body of the F connector won't turn round when you have a cable connected. And we get this turned right round and get it very, very tight. Very difficult to do uh, with your fingers when the ports are so close together. So that's has got two extremely tight F connectors fitted onto this quad LMB. And as you can see, it would not be difficult to populate the other ports uh, using this tool 
removal of the F connectors, if you want to take the cables off for replacement or testing or whatever, just slide the tool over again, give it a good twist, and there you go, and there's the, the connector coming off. Much, much easier than using your fingers or even pliers, uh, as a lot of installers tend to do as a, as, as a shortcut. So there's the connector off. So all in all, an extremely useful little tool and uh, hopefully uh, you may find a requirement for this when you're doing your satellite jobs. So thank you for watching this video presentation. Thank you.